Day 12. Day 12 it is. I'm filming this one right after doing a 45-minute a meditation. I was curious how that would change or impact what came up or came through. My friend Cam Hogan has got a program called Solitude 60, where for 60 days straight, you sit with yourself for 60 minutes at a time. And then he records a video directly after. And originally, Naval Ravikant started the program and Cam has made ways to try to grow it. And it's such a cool idea. And I am recording this video right now after meditating and it's a different feel to it just internally so could be something for you to check out um what came up in the meditation today was what happens when you don't grow um i was listening to a podcast that i listened to in college a lot called part of my take and it's run by these two incredibly funny guys got big cat and pft the hosts and the producer of the show is a guy named Hank. And I was listening to it today. And Hank, the producer, said something that struck me so vividly. Like, it just... It, it really got to me where he said, I live a Peter Pan lifestyle with this job. I feel like time is just kind of stopped since we started the podcast. It's probably bad that I don't feel any different than I did when the podcast started, but I don't. I was 22 when the podcast started. I'm 31 now. But I feel like I think in the exact same way as I did back then. It's just like I'm a little bit better off in life. And I heard him say that on the most recent episode and I was like, oh my God. Oh my God, that's my greatest fear. He literally just outlined my greatest fear. And it's quite humorous that I'm listening to this podcast, the same podcast that I was listening to in college, as a way to do the same things in this moment that I was doing in college, which is avoiding responsibility. And the truth is I, I do feel like I've grown. I do feel like I've, I've changed. But I also recognize that in this very season of life, I'm doing the thing that I'm scared of. And when he said that, I was like, oh my God. Oh my God. That is not how I, I'd like to end up. And, you know, part of me wishes that I did want that. That I could put up with that in a way. Of living the same life from 22 to 31. I mean, I, I did it from, let's say, 9 to 18 in some sense. And from 18 to 23, living the exact same life. And I almost wish that I could. I almost wish that it was, it was something I was able to do. I just live the same life over and over, think the same thoughts. And I can't. Like, I... I absolutely can. I mean, I've been doing that for the past month in some sense. But to live in a state where I'm not growing, to I'm not changing, I'm not gaining awareness. To me, I, I, I'm so scared to live that reality. And so I really appreciate the quote from him. It's his birthday. It was his birthday, I guess, this week. 
and it and it just highlighted oh wow like this is what i'm this is what i'm working for this is why i'm i'm meditating to gain awareness this is why i'm recording these videos because this was not something that i could have done a year ago or two or five or like i'm working to grow i'm on this planet to grow i'm i'm not here to do the same things that i've been doing and the quote hit me and it's so real I live a Peter Pan lifestyle with this job. I feel like time has just kind of stopped since we started the podcast. It's probably bad that I don't feel any different than I did when the podcast started, but I don't. I was 22 when the podcast started. I'm 31 now, but I feel like I think in the exact same way as I did back then. I'm just a little bit better off in life. No, that's... Every when I read that quote, every part in me says that's mailing it in. And I and I'm scared of that. I'm fearful of that reality. And I want to grow. I want to change. I want to develop. I want to build myself. I want to learn. And thanks for going on the journey with me. Let's have some fun. Day 12, out. Peace.